All right, today we're modifying one of our hog traps we got out here. Last night I got a picture of some little baby pigs in the trap with no mama. Um, Dad saw them when he was bow hunting here a few weeks ago, but right the way the trap is now, the, oh, the holes in it are too big and the little pigs will be able to fit out of it. We'll be able to go right through the holes in the trap. Yep. See? And we had an old hog trap over there. The, the gate's too small that the hogs don't really go in because they're scared, scares them. And we're stealing the panels off it. They're a little closer together to put on the bottom of this hog trap and we ain't really got enough to go around so we are improvising yeah we're cutting cutting the fit now these are expensive these yeah. things are like 70 bucks a panel these are like i don't know how much these are but they're like cheaper yeah these but th when you put them around the bottom like that i mean the pig you know he's going to jump pretty high the so. pigs are little yeah. so um which all of these are five by 16 panels and we have how many of these? Eight of these big ones to make up this trap? Ain't that right? Five. Five. I can't five count. We had five of these that makes up this whole big trap right here. And um, on the little hog trap that we're robbing off of, we only had two. So we're cutting them like they're five foot tall. So we cut two feet like from the side they're 16 <laughs> they're 16 oh they're 16 inches long so we cut like cut two foot from the sides what is that coon poop i'm too hungry to be trying to explain all this mathematical stuff anyways these things are five foot tall so this is actually what they were i'll show them when we go cut another one that's easier than trying to explain it saying that we cut we're it from eight cuts out of a 16 foot panel and we're turning them yeah sideways. So yeah like they're five feet long cutting two it's foot from the around. sides that's 16 that we gotta have yeah so. and getting eight out of it so we're taking the two panels and getting you know like he said, eight cuts out of it so that we could cover the bottom of the trap so that when we catch these small pigs that would fit through the holes, it'll... Speaking of holes, you know, one right there? It'll hold them in and, you know, they'll have to jump if they want to get out of these holes. And we got them stuck in the ground a little bit so they won't be digging out. Yeah. Oh, they'll dig out. We just got to get them before they do dig Yeah, out. which we've got the stealth cam cellular on here where it sends the pictures to an app on my phone. And then we've got the Ooh. hog balls gate system here. So it sends the pictures to my phone. I wait until all the pigs get in the trap. And when they do, I call a number and it sets the trap off, sets the gate off and we catch the pigs. Come down here and get them. Yeah, I can't talk right this morning cause I ain't had nothing to eat. Good. And that ain't that ain't good. All I've had this morning's coffee, which if I didn't have the coffee, I'd really be in a fix. That black rifle's yeah. kind of hooked up on some coffee. A little black rifle coffee kept me going this morning. But hmm. I need some more calories. Are we just putting this up here with some copper wire because it'll that'll hold it. Yeah. Cause they're gonna be busting it. They're gonna be hitting it pretty hard, but just some just hold it up here for yep. a second. Okay, this is 
a metal, you know, about like this. This is not what I use when you hook up. I just give you another screw. Like, oh my god. Yep, and then we get to go get some to eat. <laughs> Tripped over the root. No, it's not bay. I don't, I don't know what it is. But let me tell you you talking about some cover scent. It That's looks stuff. like them, but it's, it don't yeah, it smell don't just like them. It looks like a pawpaw too, but it's not. <clears throat> okay, so what I was trying and failing to explain a while ago is we're cutting them from the... Yeah, counting 24, because each of these are two inches wide, so counting 24 will get you two feet. Makes them all five foot long, because they're five foot tall, and two foot wide, because we'll be laying them down sideways yeah well you getting more see if we went the other way and you cut them in the three three runs then we would have only had like what what do we say 20 inches so yeah. we're getting four inches more by doing it like this we sat here with the calculator because now that i'm out of school i forgot how to multiply <laughs> but i'm gonna take this over there and... oh we got a rope on the bottom oh this one did <laughs> extra yeah. yeah, it's all good. Yeah, yeah I got it. Watch me trip over this rope. Mm -hmm. There's a copper wire we're tying this stuff together with. We're right behind my uncle's house out here. He's got a big cabinet shop up on the road. And look at this mess. You can see where deer have been coming in here. See the deer tracks? We got all kind of pictures of deer on the stealth cam. <laughs> and this new feed we've been putting out by Southern Seed and Feed. We put it out hoping the pigs would love it, but the darn deer love it too. We got regular corn, and we got the new feed. Testing them out. I don't know. 
You mean like we might have too many? Yeah, well, we will if we cut off. Did it eat? No. Save that money. Well, there's a lot of antis that won't like it, but. Yeah, but.
That's the horse you rode right there, ain't you? That's the one we should have started with right here, kid. Should have started with this piece of wire right here. We've been done a long time ago. <laughs> uh, Not too bad, huh? How to keep the little pigs in here. Because last night, you got pictures of... Well, you remember I did that video way back there on mm -hmm. pigs that's, you know, this tall. I mean, there's no way that you're going to keep them with these big holes like this. Matter of fact, the hogs that we caught the other day, those, those pigs that we caught the other day were so small, they almost went through the, through the holes at the bottom. And these are bigger holes. Baking bits. Yeah. But, hey, that's, you know, seriously, that's the best eating size. Really. The small ones like that. Yeah. Oof. They're good. But, oh, Alabama Living read an article. If you don't take 70% of the herd each year off of a, any given whatever piece of land, oh, you're backing up. 70% of the population of hogs needs to be we taken off. We can't keep off. up with them. And that's just to maintain the numbers that we've got now. They populate so fast. Yeah. Well, they said that they have at least two litters, I think two litters one year, three the next, and they have uh, six, six to 12? At least. I've six seen them more than 12. I know, but 6 to 12 is an average, average of what, what they're having. It don't take long, y'all. We got a problem. Everybody says, man, I'm starting to see hog sign on my place. Trap them. Get in there and start trapping them right now. You yeah. can buy that box right there for $600 and build your own stuff. $600 and you can be set up just like we are right here, right now. I mean, I built the gate. You saw it. You know, we built the corral. I mean, it's nothing to it. You can build it out of anything. Yeah. You can build it out of pallets. You can build it out of sawmill slab. You can build it out of treated sure it's lumber. Strong. Yeah, it's just got to be, you know, it's got to be pretty stout. Because these pigs are strong. Yeah, too. they stout. And, and I don't even know that this will hold up, but we're going to try it and see. We're going to see how it works. And get a bunch of people saying, y'all kill all this stuff. Y'all ain't eating it all. Bet. Do y'all yeah. know how much I eat? Yeah, y'all know it. how much I can eat in one day of all this stuff? And, well, see, I mean, they, we ate sausage from these things. Yeah, and they say that, you know, I didn't this morning because no I didn't eat breakfast. Got a freezer, but you got to think about this. We never buy meat, okay? So, if, you, if you're if you eating on a, if you're eating on, say, three Except or four deer food. that we killed in Kansas, and you're eating on four or five hogs. It don't and, last long. It don't take long because Not you're like eating, people think. eating it every day. It ain't like, oh, I need to kill a couple of deer this year so I can have deer meat every yeah. now and then. No, I promise you, folks, we're not wasting day. this stuff. We're not and just killing it and laying it in the ditch somewhere. We're, 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 we're giving it We're not killing people. it just for the fun of it or for the sport. For one, if these ho if we don't take these hogs out, they're going to take over the whole place anyways. Well, we don't have the deer no more. No, we ain't killed a deer here this year because the hogs have took over. Yeah. I mean, you can't kill, you know, you can't, they, they run them out. Yeah, they're bad on everything. They're bad they're on crops. Oh, yeah, I mean, they, they just. Livestock. They ain't supposed to be here. No, they're invasive. Yeah, they're not supposed to be here. And um, I had my mom text me yesterday, said, can you kill me another deer before season goes out so I can make sausage out of it? We've already gave them several deer this year. Um, but like I was asking him earlier. Don't pigs make better sausage because they got fat in them? When yeah. deer, usually when people make sausage out of deer, it's they have dry. to add fat or it's crazy yeah. dry. With it's hogs, dry. they make the best sausage. Yeah. We was eating sausage from hogs the other day. From well, that, yeah, big that big sow that hog big sow. that I made the video of last. We had to carve the fat off of it because it was too much. It was too much she fat. She had on. so much fat on her. Yeah, but we ain't wasting. We're not wasting, and if we're not eating it, somebody else is. Yeah, we give them away. Yeah. We feed our neighbors, mom and my stepdad. Hi. Um, yeah, everybody. friends and family, anybody that wants them. Yeah. Come on. If somebody wants a hog, you know, that's close by. Or I mean, a deer. We can't, you know, we can't keep it in a trap forever, you know, but I've got some boy from, uh, he was from uh, South Mississippi. He said he was two hours from here. He said, next time you catch him. Some he said, holler at me. He said, I'll be on the way to get them. And I'm going to holler at you. I said, come on, dude. Come get them. Yep. Because, uh, like I said, we're not going to... We're not throwing them in a ditch somewhere or something. Or, 
or putting them in the freezer or somebody else's freezer. Somebody's eating. Yep. That's where we are right now, though. We done. We about to yeah, go and get this something. Is our, this is our private property that we're yeah. trying to. I mean, this is some private land. I mean, it's just, just a small section, but. But it's over on the hogs. Yeah, I mean, you can't kill deer for the hogs. And used to. Okay. When I first bought this piece of land. I might have to make land, two videos out of this. When I first bought this piece of property right here, we had 15 bucks on camera, didn't we? Yeah. Now, we had maybe one or two, and then the hogs moved back in. Yeah. You got nothing. Nothing. You got some does, you know, and it is, I guess they've gotten used to hogs, so they, you know. Put a little bit more out here to maintain them while we're gone. I think this southern seed and feed, they're mostly sold in the south. Yeah. But the company based out of Mississippi. Good folks. This is just corn. Yeah. That's what I was explaining a while ago. We got the corn and the stuff. This is, this, this is the stuff that's got like the peanut butter rice bran and all. Yeah. It smells so good. Yeah, the stuff that all you need is a, a half a gallon of milk in a bowl. Yeah. And we'll believe it. Good to go. Yeah, like cereal, man. I mean, ha we were putting it out yesterday and Hannah said, they didn't get home. It smells good. It, it smells like smell peanut butter. It smells too good. And it's a magnet. But look at the, did you show them the deer tracks where the deer's coming? I already have. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. Just built the trail. This will probably be two videos because this video alone is already 10 minutes long and I try not to make them too far over 10 minutes. But well, just shorten it up on part one and part two just... Be ready for it. Put yeah, put a little bit outside. Well, that big hog I saw the other day never came inside. It takes them a little while to get used to it. Yeah, you can see all out there where the hogs have it rooted up. But yep. Now I can finally go get me some beef. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all. Making money, kid. Uh -huh. We didn't even use the screw. Well, that's the screws that's we took screw. out. Yeah, I had to. That other trip. Yeah, might do for some new power tools. Let's get a little. Let's get a little.